Americans fighting hard on all the battle fronts. My good friends, people I've never met, the young and the old. Everybody's working together as one. They're all here. All my friends are here. I know one thing for sure about this war. We'll win! <sighs> Chill out, Naruto. Stay mellow, my man. Dang, that thing is hard. Didn't even make a scratch. My mask is still like new. I expect more from the one in control of the Nine Tails. <laughs> Same thing going on. And Madara's eyes, too. His mask has two holes in it. Unlike the other mask, this one is special. Made extra sturdy for battle. That left eye he was always hiding. It was the same Rinnegan that Nagato and the other Madara had. Hmm? We'll stop both of you Madaras. Both? What do you mean, both, fool? This guy's the only mother, all right? I see. So you know, then. The real Madara appeared on another battlefield, which means you're a fake. <laughs> Would you prefer to call me by my former name of Toby? Now that the war has begun, the name is irrelevant. Tell me. Who are you? I am no one. And I don't want to be anyone. All that matters now is that Project Tsukinomi succeeds. There's no reason to exist in this hopeless world. Eugene Churiki were forced to host the Tail Beasts and have only known despair. Am I mistaken? I'm sure the lot of you have some understanding of the despair I speak of. Don't assume being bonded to a tailed beast is a bad thing. Even in this world you say is useless. That I am no one garbage is not gonna cut it when you start a freaking war. Even if you change that ugly mask, use a bunch of fake names, and keep trying to feed us your lies! You'll always be you! Freak face! Now I'm mad. And I'm gonna enjoy ripping that mask off of you! To take off this mask, we'll have to break some bones. It's on! If you want to fight me, you'll have to deal with them first. Six of them now? That's too much to stand, because we can't battle as originally planned. Going down like this, I see no end in sight. How about we split them up for a better fight? Is it better to take them all at once, or split them up? B's got a point. I think we can take them all at once. Uh, if we get separated, me and B can't work together. That's too risky. It may be a tough battle, but we can pull it off. Hear what he's saying? It makes some sense. Fighting two together can boost our confidence. Let the battle begin. Let's <laughs> go. 
struggles against these odds. longer than I thought. I'll give you that. <sighs> but no matter how long you fight, it's all for nothing. You cannot dispute my fighting ability outmatches yours. Not yet. But why? Why be so stubborn? Hurry up and take care of that masked man. It makes me sick thinking of him in control of the tailed beasts. Right, you got it. You know, Nine Tails, someday I want to do something about the hatred that's inside you, too. I promised all the Jinchuriki and the Tail Beasts and him that I would. And I never break a promise. And I never, ever go back on my word. That's my ninja way! Yes. That's the Naruto I know. Keep it. Is there no end to your babbling? Watch! I'll get out of this somehow! If you want to borrow some power from me, I won't object, Naruto. I'm glad you want to let me borrow some power. But before that, there's something I want to say. <laughs> Thanks for giving me power against that other Madara. That really bailed me out. 
No need to get mushy. The only reason for that is because you're a better option than Madara. And besides, I could only give you a little chakra anyway, because of this cage. I just grew a little more interested in your fight this time, that's all. Yep, just to pass the time. Why are you so mad that I said thanks? Even if you can't change that look of yours, we need to really work on your attitude. Huh? Bond our chakra together. Are you kidding me? Another chakra tug of war? We don't have to do that this time, dummy. Even though I am kind of bored at the moment, that might liven things up a bit. Just give me the power, you freaking fox! You're a frail little guy, aren't you? You should be grateful to me. Okay, who do you want to kill? Stop coming out already! You have infuriated me, Naruto! I promise I won't do wrong by you. So just hang in there for a little while. Don't assume being bonded to a tailed beast is a bad thing. That demon fox for sure. But Naruto is different. I know he is. That boy. That boy is one of my best students. He's a black horse, but obsessive, which can make him clumsy at times. And others don't see his talent because of it. He knows what it's like to suffer. And he's no longer a demon fox. Now, he's an asset to the Hidden Leaf Village. Naruto Uzumaki! You're not a demon fox anymore. You're an asset to the leaf. You're my partner. Kurama! Anyway, let's get going! Too late. The power of the Nine Tails. Let the battle begin! Hey, let me make this clear. I'm not about to sit around and do nothing at a time like this. Our first move to take our least state is a perfect soul. This is always too long. This isn't 
in the last two. We have got the nine tails of the beast. Still nothing in the face of five tailed beasts. I guess he doesn't know about my power. We only get away with that once. Show what we can do and scare the chakra out of it. The reaction to the tail beast bombs has gotten slower than before. Now's your time to act, my tails. Shut your trap. I'll take orders from you. I should have known.
The tailed beasts are slowing down. Nine tails. It's getting too risky to send out the tailed beasts. Seems you are fresh out of Chakra. <laughs> this battle is over. I win. So what if I'm out of Chakra? Uzumaki. I never imagined you'd acquire so much power. But my battle is not over, and the hatred will not cease. I will do what I have to do.
to see my plan through to the end. The Nine and Eight Tails will be mine. <laughs> I promise you. He ran away. But still... You are off the hook, baby! Naruto! Hey, man, you... After all that, can you blame him? <laughs> you the man, yo. You really are, bro. And that wraps up the battle reports from each field. We took some major damage. But let's just rejoice that he didn't take over our world. Yeah. And also that Naruto and Killer B got out of this alive. Never in a million years did I expect the real Madara to show his face here. He held his own against all five of us. That's a dangerous opponent. And then... There's also the fake one with the mask. Something tells me we'll be fighting them both again one day. The Ninja Alliance must stay alert at all times. Let's hold another strategy conference on the coming decisive battle. And we'll need to reform the educational system of each village to produce ninja with adaptable fighting skills. Yeah, now that we've come this far, we've got nothing to hide from each other. Nothing to hide from each other. Hmm. What is it, Lord Raikage? To tell you the truth, when we formed this alliance, I never thought our relationship would hold up like this. I thought each village was in this for their own interests, to see how much they could profit from the war. I honestly thought that once the war was over, we'd all go back to how we were before. But reality has proven me very wrong. We're trying to bring the world together as one, in the truest sense. I'm starting to think there really is a little hope for a new era. <laughs> well, to usher in that new era, it all depends on how we carry ourselves from here on out. First, we need to beat Madara. Everything else comes after that. I hear you. Which raises the question, how do we handle Killer B and Naruto, considering how crucial they are? That reminds me, Lady Hokage. How is he doing? Still sawing logs. Normally, the Nine Tails would speed up his recovery. But this time, it seems even he was worn to a frazzle. Look at him, out like a light. Maybe we... Don't worry, he's fine. He'll wake up soon. Well, that's good to hear. Naruto Uzumaki. The world is slowly starting to change. The light you showed us is making waves across the world. The way to peace really does exist. And now true peace is within our grasp. Huh? Where? Oh, it must be a dream. Every now and then, you can tell when you're dreaming. Well, what's the deal here? I can't see anything. I usually don't get dreams this weird. D Dad! Mom! Dad! Mom! Huh? 
Okay. I will. This is a story about a hero. He never hesitated, despite the approaching... He fought to the end, to protect what was precious to him. This is the story of a hero. The story of a hero I love. Oh! 